Who the fuck are you? Do, is he always standing there? I've only just noticed him. Oh god, this frame rate. Yeah, I think I got that guy. And maybe the guy next to him, too. Okay then, what is this thing? MSP worth it? Let's, let's board it, let's see what's going on here. Empty. Most of the systems are shut down. It's just running on basic life support. could be a trap. Think I dead? Jacob's not going to make it. His brain was deprived of oxygen for too long. There's nothing any of us can do for him now except let him die with dignity. It's what he would want. I'm more worried about Julia now. She's showing signs of severe depression. I gave her some meds that should help, but I better warn the captain. Huh. That machine's keeping him alive. I'm not seeing any brain activity on the readouts. He's dead. This body is just an empty shell. Leave him alone until we know more about what's going on here. You're right. Better to just leave him be for now. God, this is unnerving. They say Jacob's gone. They say his brain isn't functioning anymore, and they want to shut off his machines. Whoa. But Jacob's the only thing in the world that matters to me. I don't know how to help him, but it's tearing me up inside. I just feel so helpless, so damn angry. Dr. Smith gave me some meds to calm down, but I didn't take them. I can't. Not until I figure out a way to help Jacob. I won't give up on him. I won't. All right, so I'm guess I'm gonna hit a quick save because I'm guessing that whatever's gonna be happening out here. Or there's nobody. Where the fuck is everyone? This shit's so Jacob bad. is showing no signs of brain activity. There's nothing more we can do for him. He wouldn't want to be kept alive by machines, so we're going to disconnect the life support. Doctor Smith is worried about Julia's reaction, though. <clears throat> she can't seem to let Jacob go. The stress is making her implants flare up, causing intense migraines. It'll probably be easier for everyone if we don't tell her until after we shut the life support down. Give her a chance to. Julia, what are you doing here? Why are you- <laughs> Okay, that happened. That was a mission? I didn't even realize I had a mission for out here. You did the right thing, Shepard. Thanks, Tyler. Ouch! Okay, I was about to ask if he still explode when I approach them. Which is at the very... Very, uh, like... The complicated dile ow, dilemma of whether or not to take a guy off life support and then 
they just watched me walk into a landmine on purpose twice. <gasps> Why do these people follow me? Yeah, where was that woman hiding? She just appeared. Uh, apparently in front of, like, Rex and Tally, because they, uh, kind of clapped her quick. It was, it was, it was so funny, cause <laughs> She's just suddenly there, and then, uh, Rex just blasts her through the doorway. That's gold! That, that is just a big old block of gold, jeez. Come on, you belly goat. No! Fucking... What's the point in the windows when it's just when the window is just facing a rock wall? I'll never understand urban living. I was a little I I had enough time to worry that I might take fall damage. Every fall is worse when you have time to contemplate, am I going to take damage from this? Actually, that reminds me, so, uh, my grandpa, he was in the Air Force, and something he told me is that if you have enough time to contemplate whether you're, the fall will kill you, it's probably going to kill you. Okay, so, since it's having make me land somewhere, I'm guessing it's gonna screw me over. Like, th this seems like it's gonna be a double cross. Hello again, Commander Shepard. I owe you a debt of gratitude. You also owe me money. my partner's dead, this syndicate is now mine. I could not have done it without you. Those men deserve to die. Now are we going to have a problem? Not if I can help it, Commander. I hope you can see that I am by far a lesser evil than those men. Under my leadership, this organization will restrict itself to gambling and smuggling illegal technologies. There will be no drugs and no slave-taking for the Batarians. Those days are over. This gang has a reputation for drugs and slaving. It's too late to change that. Perhaps you're right. Perhaps this organization has been so tainted by those two idiots that it cannot be redeemed. If I disband the gang, I walk away freely. I have not come so far to be arrested. I would die before going to prison. I would most certainly kill before going to prison. Now, do we have a deal? You're free to go. I don't ever want to see this gang again. If I do... You won't. I'm not so foolish as to break my word to a Spectre. Now, if you'll excuse me, my men become nervous in the presence of law enforcement agents. <laughs> Goodbye, Shepard. Uh huh. All right, cool. Bunch of Om. Wait, do is that it? Do I get paid an Omni Gel for all that shit? Okay, these guys just fucking hang out, I guess. It's weird seeing them just standing around like that. I like that they're just standing around and watching me fucking rob their asses. I don't have anything particularly good, you bunch of jackasses. Gosh. Hmm. I am curious. Oh, I can't shoot them. I, I, I had the idea that maybe I can shoot them now that I've, you know, uh, now they're just sitting ducks, but no. I have to leave peacefully. Okay, what's this gonna be about? Rear Admiral Mihailovic, 
Fifth Fleet. Commander Shepard, SSV Normandy. You don't know who I am, do you, Commander? No. I command the 63rd Scout Flotilla. You and the Normandy were slated for my unit after shakedown. Then the Council got their paws, claws, tentacles, whatever. They got them on our ship and you. I still serve the Alliance, sir. As a Spectre, I can advance our interests to the Council. Hmm. You still know what color your blood is, Shepard? I don't begrudge the politician's decision to throw you to the Council. It's an opportunity. I do begrudge this over-designed piece of tin, though. This ship saved our lives a dozen times over. An exaggeration. I've read your reports. This experiment diverted billions from our appropriations bills for the same price we could have had a heavy cruiser. But no, we had to make nice to the Turians, throw money at a co-developed boondoggle. I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. We'd be honored to show her to you, Admiral. I'll just bet. Wait here. I won't be long. Commander, I'm not happy. Sounds like a fairly common situation. Commander, I suggest you secure your mouth. It's going to get you in trouble. Who designed that CIC? Putting the commander aft of everyone else is inefficient. What if he needs to discuss with the operators toward the bow? Modified Turian style. They prefer commanders looking over their subordinates rather than in the middle of them. We wanted to see how effectively they can command with that setup. Hmm. Reasonable goal, but they should have studied that in a lab rather than on a frontline warship. I had to shake my head at that drive core of yours. 120 billion credits of element zero to make this thing able to move without giving itself away. You realize we could make drive cores for 12,000 fighters with that money? What good is it to hide for a few hours anyway? Useless. We can loiter in an enemy system and monitor traffic or drop infiltration teams on enemy worlds. Normandy can be more effective than the Solarian STG. Maybe, maybe. But that's not the job of a proper warship. We're supposed to find and kill the enemy fleet, not count how many times their garrison goes to the bathroom. And we need to talk about your crew, Oh my Commander. god! Krogan? Turians? What are you thinking, Commander? You can't allow alien nationals free access to Alliance equipment? Between Saren and the Geth, we have enough enemies out here. Treating other species with suspicion and distrust won't win hearts and minds. That assumes the hearts and minds are worth winning. That hasn't been proven yet. You have anything else to say, Commander? Any other justifications for the state of this vessel? I think the Normandy is a good ship, sir. Even if you disagree, you have to see that her joint construction and multiracial crew make the Alliance look better. Your job is to look good, Commander. The Alliance Navies is to win wars. I'm not convinced Normandy isn't a waste of taxpayer money. But I am convinced that you believe otherwise, and that you'll use it to its best ability. I'll be submitting a report to the Joint Military Council. It will not be as negative as I had planned. Good hunting, Commander Shepard. Make us proud. <laughs> that gives me a level up. That gives me a level up. Really? We're going to be fighting more guests, so I'm going to start putting into hacking. It's <laughs> it made me jump a little. Uh, when, when Rex appeared on screen, it made me jump a little. Forgot that he takes up the entire screen. Presidium technicians are struggling to understand why a computer system catastrophically overloaded recently. I had nothing to do with are it. Reported Commander Shepard, sorry to bother you. This is Lieutenant Girard down in the docking bay. There is a woman here. Uh, she was rescued from Batarian slavers a few weeks ago. She is from Mindwar. I guess she was taken in the raid on your town. She's been a slave for the past 13 years? Is she all right? Not really. She's a little messed up. She got free somehow, grabbed a gun from one of my guys. Now she's holed up here in the docking bay. She, uh, she says she wants to die. I hoped you'd talk to her. It's a long shot, but you went through the same thing. The raid. I figured maybe you could talk her out of her tree. I'm on my way, Lieutenant. Sit tight. Commander, glad to see you. Wish it were under better circumstances. Where is she? Behind those shipping containers. 
I've got a sniper position, but I don't think we'll need him. She's only a danger to herself. We've got a sedative to calm her down, but we can't get close to her. Every step we take gets her more wound up. I hope I don't need it. Tell your men to stand by. Don't push her too hard. If she seems liable to pull the trigger, back off, or walk away. I am willing to wait her out. Good luck, Commander. Stop! Stop! What are you... What are you? My name is Shepard. Lieutenant Gerard sent me to talk to you. What's your name? Animals don't get names. The Masters put their symbols on her. Hot metal all over her back. She screams when they do it. You're not an animal. Your parents. What did they call you? Do you remember them? She remembers a lot of things. Talitha. They call her that. She... She doesn't remember the rest. Leave her alone. What's the last thing you remember from Mindwa? Fires. Smells of smoke and burning meat. Animals screaming at She pretends to be dead. If she's dead, she can't work. But they know! She, she didn't fight. She was already broken. Talitha, you were what, six years old? No one blames you for staying quiet and hoping they'd go away. The only person blaming you is you. She wants to believe that. She doesn't want to be there anymore. In the pen, in the cages, lying quiet while they do things to her. How did you get here? She can't escape. They have chains, wires, needles. You go too far, they take your brain. Animals like her come. Animals with guns. She tries to fix the masters so they won't be mad at her. She puts all the reds and purples back in, but they don't move. You were afraid. All you'd known for 13 years was the masters. She doesn't want to see other animals. They're not real. If the animals can see her, then this is real. But it can't be. This doesn't happen to her. It's another girl. A dirty... It happens to her. Doesn't it? They see her, so it's real. She doesn't God, want it this to be is real. Fucked up. What happened this is why we kill all Batarian's kids, remember. There's... She sees them. They're yelling. Run! Hide! Shh! She doesn't want to see that! Don't make her look! Don't look! Stupid, stupid! I know it hurts, Talitha. I'm sorry. But you need to deal with... When she thinks, water comes out of her eyes. She sees them. Mommy, they're dead, Shepard. They try to save her in the Master's birth. Can she stop remembering now, please? I was on Mindwar. My parents died in the raid. Lying? You get hit for lying? Get the buzz? Why are you alive? Why are you? Why aren't you like her? Broken. Only fit to dig and carry. For a while, I was broken. I lost my whole family, Talitha. My friends. My childhood. I had to pull myself up and keep going. You lose your mommy and daddy, but you don't... She wishes she could stand up. I'm going to take a step towards you now. Okay? No! She's no good! Don't want to be handled again! I'm going to take a step towards you now. Oh shit, did I waste all okay. the dialogue earlier? She doesn't want... Don't touch her! I'm going to take a step towards you now. Okay? I... Uh, I'm... Please don't touch her! She's dirty. You'll catch it. Talitha. This will make you sleep. If you fall asleep, they'll take you to a place where you can get better. Will she have bad dreams? You'll dream of a warm place, and when you wake up, you'll be in it. She'd like that. It hurts when she... 
when I remember me. She, she wants to remember. Is it over, Commander? She took the sedative. She wants to get better, Lieutenant. Thanks, Commander. That means a lot. I didn't want to hurt her. It's just... when I see her cur... She was only six when they took her. Why the hell are we out here if we can't even keep one little girl safe? Kill all Batarians! To make people who do these things pay. It's not the severity of punishment that deters crime. It's the certainty. So we clean up the wreckage, shoot the guilty, and hope everyone else learns not to mess with us? Great. I'll take care of it from here, Commander. Hmm, guess not, I guess that wasn't the right answer for him. Well, time for me to make dinner, so I guess uh, this is a good time to wrap it up. Uh, you all have a good day.